I remember my elders telling me stories about a skilly who slumbers somewhere deep in the woods. It came into this world by manifesting itself from all the hate and anger between tribes. This monster would cause chaos in villages, causing men to lose their minds and women and children to become diseased. The rivaling tribes had to work together to banish the creature to the forest, and that whoever disturbs its slumber, disturb the beast within. As a security guard? Yeah, he was gonna come here with me, but he shipped on until I think six. Oh, I, yeah, I think Taylor actually started working down there last week. And he got his license to carry too, like on Monday. Yeah. Does he think he's all oh, oh, yeah. big and bad? Well, freaking, you know, chest boosted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the same way Bryce was when he got his license. <laughs> nice. So I have noticed you in town a lot here lately. Why haven't you that carpenter job? You know, the traveling part. That's the thing, man. I got tired of traveling. So I asked them for a transfer, and they gave me a manager job right off the bat head down here at the lumber yard. So I'm here in town a lot more lately. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it worked out great. So I'm I'm here. Uh, I got your message. You sounded super excited. So uh, uh, hear me out. You know that old abandoned house over there by Grove? That one passing the Millers? Yeah. You know the one we played in as we was kids? Yeah, that that creepy house that we played in as kids. <laughs> yeah. I I bought it. You uh, bought it? Yeah. I bought the land, bought the house. I mean, think about it. I want to fix it up. You know, and maybe one day all of us move in and after it's done, I mean, you have to move in and, you know, like, have a just kind of like a party house and go drink, and drink a little, you know. But think about it. I looked into it. It's not going to cost very much. I mean, it's already there. We just, you know, you know a few fixer-uppers and, you know, nothing. <laughs> oh, so, uh, you come to me because I'm the carpenter <laughs> and I, you know, I didn't know. Skill, you know. I'm joking. I know what you, I know what you mean. Uh, uh, what do you think? I mean, are you down? You in? I'm in. Alright. God, it's been forever since I've been down at that house. Oh man, I was just down there last Friday. And that's when I bought it, you know? Yeah. I remember when you guys used to always try to come over and get me to come out. My mom would have a hard time letting me go. Oh gosh. She's always, don't play out after dark, something to play with you. <laughs> I remember her stories, you know, about skillies, you know, an elbow lady. I mean, but I think the worst one was the deer lady. Oh. Oh man, she has a scary story. That was wicked. <laughs> but yeah, dude, you down? I'm down. All right. Appreciate the consideration. No problem. Voicemail? Someone actually left a voicemail? Hey Taylor, this is Jace. We're all out here at the cabin, drinking a cold one. You should really come out. <laughs> that was weird. Who was it? It was Jace, but like, he sounded weird. I don't know what the deal was. But um, I guess all the boys are drinking tonight. They're over at that house that we're fixing up. Um, they asked me to come out. I'm not going to go. Why not? Uh, I'm just going to stay here, I guess. No, go. 
Really? Yeah. Are you cool with it? You, do you want to go? No, no, it's a guy's night. Go ahead. You're not going to get anything here, so go ahead and have fun with your guys. All right. Well, uh, I'll, I'll call you when I get there and let you know that I made it. All right. Um, all right. Uh, Okay. Hey, don't wear that shirt. Huh? The game's tomorrow. Oh. I gotta close in the trunk. Alright, I'll call you later. Alright, bye. Loves, kisses. Does that look four foot to you? Uh, you guys are idiots, man. <laughs> so what do you want me to do? Go put them back? Yeah, go put them back. You go with them. So sit down, God. You dumb. I think we got a lot done today. Yeah, I mean, it's looking more like a house now. What time is it? Hang on. Nine, o'clock. Still kind of early. What do you say? Crack open a few brewskis. Hell yeah! Yo, Bryce Beerus Bush. Woo! All right, do it. You remember when this fool was wide open in the end zone and drops the <laughs> damn ball? Oh yeah, I was hurt that game. You lost the game for us. Hey, the sun was my eyes, okay? I have, that's my excuse. Oh boy! Didn't your dad ever teach you that when the ball goes into the sun, you try and catch the sun? It's an old Indian trick. Uh -huh. Oh! <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> what was that? What the hell was that? Hey Bryce, go check it out. <laughs> Why does that have to be me? <laughs> Damn, that's fucking scary. You're an asshole. <laughs> Hello? What'd you think it was? A raccoon or a squirrel or something. That's a big ass raccoon. Have you seen the shit upstairs? I mean, it's a big pile of dung. I'm not seeing anything out here, guys. I think it was the house. Because it is old as shit. I don't think there's anything to worry about, guys. He said he hasn't seen anything. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here.
Is that you? Taylor? Hold on, hold on. Get the fuck back! I saw what you did to Bryce. I didn't do that. That was Nate! Nate? Where the hell's Nate? I don't know. The last time I seen him, he was downstairs. I said get the fuck back! Just stay there till I figure this all out. Man, you gotta believe me, okay? You know me. Get back! I know both of you. Either one of you could have done this. Think about it. I'm up here hiding. I mean, you could search me. There's no blood on me whatsoever. Okay, let's go downstairs, but you're going first. Fuck. Shit. Taylor, I'm so scared. I mean, I, I need a gun or something, you know? I can't trust you to be behind me right now. But don't worry, I'm gonna figure this out. I gotta get out of here. We, we gotta get out of here. Can we just get out of here? No, we gotta find Nate first and figure this out. Go on, keep going, keep going. Where's Bryce? You saw, you saw Bryce, right, when you came in? I mean, where'd he go? Pick up the gun. So did this happen after you left me that voicemail? Voicemail? Voicemail at about nine o'clock. I, I didn't call you. Where's the last place you saw Nate? I mean, I mean, uh, he was a. Uh, Come on, think. He was. Where in did you see him? He was in here. What happened next? What? What happened? What'd you do? Where did he do? Where'd you go? I went upstairs and hid. Come on, man. Let's get in the car and go. What are you doing? I'm scared. Get out of the way, then. Another one. Where'd you park? Way over by the trailer. Oh, that's convenient. We're just gonna have to do this old way. The old way? We're gonna have to run for it. Oh, that's great. Alright, you go first. Let's go to the edge. I'll be right behind you. Okay. We gotta do this now. Are you ready? Let's go. Oh god! All right, get in, get in, get in. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, please don't do this right now. Come on! I'm trying. <laughs> oh. It's a starter. Can you fix it? No, we got to push it to start it. You want to pop start it? Come on, man! It's like pulling off a band-aid. All right. Oh! Oh! Shoot him! The snake! Get out the fucking car! Shoot him! Where'd he go? 
He was right here! Where are you? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Bryce? If that's you, say something. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. I don't know what's going on. Get your gun ready. Here it is. Fuck this. Where are you going? What are you? Oh, <gasps> my